activity week two. So this is for the students to follow along with their um, homework notes. So the class would have started with the typical warm up. Go find it. Uh, with the crate game, feeding at the back, opening the front door, closing, feeding at the back. So same as you did last week in class. Then the next stage is we need to get you understanding about how to keep your dog at your side so they're paying attention to you. I know agility is all about getting the dogs to drive forward, but if your dog is forward in the early stages, they're not paying attention to you. Wherever they're uh, their nose is pointing is what they're thinking, so we need them within this zone here. It's basic um, drills for go find. It's basic drills for um, getting them to walk by your side. So the first task we have is to build value for this side. So what you're going to do is a nice simple game. You can either play it with releasing your dog from the crate to come to you. Or if your dog has got a decent sit, say, you can, you can use that. I'll just find it. So what we're going to do, your dog is either in the crate or in a sit stay. You're going to move forward and you're going to tap the side of your leg exactly in line where you want the dog to be. And you're going to release. You're going to have a treat in your hand. As your dog comes forward, to the position at the side of your leg, you're going to bring your, your hand down. So sit, stay, you're going to move forward. Okay, yes. As soon as they get to that position there, you're going to say yes. Yes, sit. Okay, yes. So I'm not luring the dog, I'm calling the dog and as they get to this position, the treat is in my hand, I'm bringing it down to that position. I mark it with the word yes. So when the dog hears the word yes, he knows that um, he's done something right and he definitely knows, knows the treat is going to fall. So, sit. Throw me. start adding steps. So a typical scenario would be one step forward, bring the treat down. One step forward, bring the treat down. One step forward, bring the treat down. When your dog's good with that, you're going to do two steps forward, bring your hand down. Three steps forward, bring your hand down. So I'm going to do two steps. Okay. One, two, three, bring my hand down. So the dog starts to think there's no point in going forward because all good things happen when I'm at your side. So remember this side, that side. Now, to help you learn to change over sides to work with them, Patch is here in the video. Patch is, go find it, over there. Go find it. Uh, what you can do is you're gonna do a couple of steps forward, cross in front of your dog. So now they're on the other side. One step forward, hand down, feet. Okay. Bring them back. They're in the start. Oh God, they're doing good. Go on, go. Okay, one, two, three, hand down, feet. Okay, so you build in value for the side. Straight line. It helps as you bring it down to keep your um, keep your memory that you need a straight line, hip, knee, feet, hip, knee, feet. Now I'm going to do this because I can't do anything. Okay, so that's what we need you to practice homework this week and then we're going to continue building on that in uh, lesson three.